So, finally getting around to posting the uh, part numbers for the Honda GX390 uh, Cyclone air cleaner. Um, and so this is all what you need here. Um, in the case of this one here, you can see I got three of the air filters. You don't need three, just for this individual order, I had ordered three of them. Um, so this piece here, and these are the Honda part numbers here. Um, this piece here is the elbow that goes from the face of the carburetor um, and is what the air filter actually mounts onto. Um, this is the entire um, top hat to the air cleaner that's got the little pre-cleaner bowls in it and everything. Of course, uh, the element and then the carburetor. The carburetor does change. Um, the original carburetors are non-compensating. They will not adjust for uh, intake restriction. And when you put the pre-cleaner on there, it, uh, it induces a little bit of uh, intake restriction. So you have to put that carburetor on there to adjust for that. <clears throat> if you try and run the Cyclone on the uh, factory carburetor, it'll run way too rich and uh, blow smoke and run like shit and spit and sputter and that kind of thing. Um, so what's cool about this deal here is that this here is for, like I said, the, uh, the Honda GX390. And this is the new style of uh, Cyclone Cleaner. They have an old style and a new style. The old style, the pre-cleaner bowl, hangs off the side of the um, air filter top hat. And, uh, and the old style also uses the original um, air filter, like the air filter part number doesn't change. Um, the problem with the old style is that they are more, uh, they add to the dimensions of the engine more. Um, because you have a pre-cleaner bolt sticks off the side of it. Um, <clears throat> I suppose one of these days I should probably get I should probably get two of my engines side by side and actually show the new style versus old style. But this here is the new style. Um, it doesn't have the 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 pre-cleaner bolt doesn't hang off the side of it, um, and it is much more compact. It's a tighter package. But the downside is that it changes the air filter. Um, so again, um, these are the part numbers for the Honda GX390 new style Cyclone. Um, if I can get these all in one shot. These are the part numbers for the Honda GX200 old style uh, Cyclone pre-cleaner. Um, and you know, just like with anything in life, there's pros and cons to the new style and the old style. Um, the cool thing about the new style 390 is it's a lot simpler. A lot of shit um, comes pre-assembled and what have you, and it's very quick and easy to swap it over. Um, partly because it's the new style, partly because it's the 390. On the 200 here with the old style, you have a lot more parts that you have to put on there. Um, but... Yeah, I don't need to ramble on about that forever. So carburetor, again, same thing. You have to have a compensating carburetor. Um, air, fil air filter seal gasket, that's just the donut on the bottom of it. Um, and you can reuse all that stuff. Um, you know, if you have an engine that's a standard air cleaner right now and you just want to convert it to the Cyclone. Um, the foam pre-filter around the air filter. I haven't written down the... Uh, air filter number but on this setup here it uses the same air filter whether it's the standard version or the cyclone um, air filter stud grommet that's a grommet in the center of the air filter um, intake elbow self-explanatory like the other one pre-cleaner bowl again self-explanatory turbine I call it a turbine I don't know what the proper term is for it um, pre-cleaner retaining plate uh, pre-cleaner bolts, air filter wing nut, again you can reuse that, uh, pre-cleaner elbow, air filter cover, valve cover and draft hose, yeah on the 200 you have to change the valve cover and the draft hose, M maybe you don't, strictly speaking maybe you don't have to but um, the Honda dealership told me that I should and so I did.
Um, I've got I've got a fairly detailed video on the 200. Uh, you can search in the videos for that. Um, and I've got a somewhat detailed-ish video on the 390. Um, but there's the part numbers.